Welcome to the third video on the Stata 101 channel, where I'm sharing the things I wish I knew when I was just starting out in Stata. Believe it or not, you can make visually impressive histograms on Stata. This is helpful for a project when you want to make an overview of your descriptive data or look more closely at uh, particular variables and their distribution. For this tutorial, I'll be using the histogram command and sample data from data world on aggregated hospital data from cancer patients. So this data set was merged from two Excel files that I got on, from, from the website, one on uh, cancer events in hospitals uh, in the US in 2012. And this was cleaned up a bit and merged with another file on hospital characteristics. And I uh, cleaned up these two files, I merged them, and um, for this uh, histogram example, I just kept the successfully merged data as seen here. So this is the chunk of code that I will be focusing on for this video. So starting with the histogram command, I've indicated uh, the number of days, the aggregate number of days that cancer patients spent in given hospitals in 2012. So this is my first variable. And I looked at this by uh, status profit of hospitals. And this is seen here in for-profit or non-for-profit hospitals. So the, this is a stratified histogram example. This uh, here indicates uh, that the histogram will show percentage instead of discrete values. I could have also written discrete here if I wanted to look at that instead. I indicate the color of the histogram bars. Stata has a lot of color options. I could look into that in another video if you're interested. And here I indicate the color of the bars as well as the percentage of transparency. And this can be played around with. You could change this to anything between 0 and 100. I indicate a Y label, and I indicate that it should be the same as the value label. So we see here for profit, non for profit. And finally, I indicate the X title, days cancer patients spent in the hospital, and that's down here below. Now, some other interesting uh, things that you could put inside of your histogram or you could indicate are you could add a normal distribution line and that could be overlaid just for a visual and you could additionally add this command well it's not a sub command it's a sub command and this will illustrate the exact number of each bar. It's a little, it's a little squished here. So you could play around with this value. Now, this is one way you can code a reproducible histogram in Stata. Stata has a ton more uh, subcommands that you could include. You could see it in uh, the help file. There's really just a lot of options that you could do to make uh, histograms that are really specific to your needs. And another really helpful option is looking at the uh, Stata cheat sheets, and I'll include the link for these uh, in the description. So thank you for watching. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe. I've also included some uh, helpful links as well as the histogram script in the description. If you have a specific question regarding this code, feel free to write it in the comments.